Hello, hello, welcome back to the channel. So, if you might have noticed, we've recently hit a thousand subscribers, and as promised, I was going to give you all a little Q&A. So, there's not really much to go over here, but there's still a considerable amount of stuff I can do, so this might be like a one minute, two minute, not quite sure long video. I'd like to thank you all for this, I'd like to thank you for the support, it's been a lot of fun, really. Anyways, with that being said, let's get right into it. So this first batch comes from our Discord server, which is linked in the description, go check it out. Anyways, let's get that started. So this first one comes from Hecto. What's up, Hecto? In terms of design, what is your favorite TVBF zombie, including exclusives and all that? So there's actually three answers to this question, as there's three zombies in particular that I actually really like out of the rest. So this one you might not know about, but it's from one of the older defeated events, coming from, I believe... 2019 to 2018 probably and its name is Nan now this isn't my image but Nan was one of the Sophia event bosses back in 2019 and it's been one of my favorites since now this may look a little familiar to the well-known pink man it's a pretty old boss back in 2019 or so there's not really much I remember about it but it's been one of my favorites now my other favorite zombie as I've said before was Ice Marauder. Look at him. I just really like Ice Marauder's design and the concept behind it. It's making a very interesting zombie and, to be honest, one of my favorites next to Titan and, of course, Planet Earth. Now I had to really battle this one out in my head for a while, but my most favorite zombie has to be Lord 3. If you've played with me in a few servers here and there, you'd notice that I'm a hardcore Lord 3 main. Right next to Planet Earth and Mystery 2. Now the main reasons why I really like Lord 3 is just the gameplay aspect overall. It's just so fun to play and it's, I can't get over it. If I'm being completely honest, I'm probably the most aggressive Lord 3 player you'll ever see. I'm not joking. Planet Earth and Lord 3 are my hardest mains on the zombie mode team, and I've gotten pretty accustomed to using them, you're gonna see me use them almost 100% of the time. Now this next one comes from Tower. Explain how you learned Roblox function, and do you know any other programming language? Now the first time I actually started scripting was around maybe 2018 to 2019, and I didn't really actually start to actually get into it until like... 2021, 2022. Now, my first ever project was World and Era, actually. Not the comic, the actual game that I was planning to do. And after a while, I scrapped it because the scripts broke, yada yada, you know, robust updates. Yeah, it's gone. After a while since that game came Extra Ops, Larry Just Drive a Car, Tower Chaos, and Scriptara Battlegrounds, which I am planning on actually keeping this time and not failing after a while. A majority of my learning on how to script came from piecing together tutorials, figuring out stuff, and just winging it, honestly. And after a while, I started to get a little bit better at it, and after a while, I actually got games now. And to answer the second part of the question, no. I actually don't know any other coding language except Lua, because that's the only one I've been really doing, and I couldn't be bothered to learn anything else, to be honest. This next one comes from Nosoyo. I think that's how it's pronounced. Fair food! Now, if I'm being 100% honest, Spaghetti. That's it. That's the answer. Now this next one comes from Jeremy. Favorite video game and experience on Roblox, which is pretty much the same thing apparently. Now it's been a bit of a change since the last video. Remember when I said Tower Blitz was one of my favorite games? It's sort of fallen off. But Decaying Winter and Tower Battles Battlefront still hold strong, obviously. Now our next one comes from Big Noob 69420 your opinions on level 101 is confidently voting for hard mode in publics. If I'm being completely honest, go for it. I mean, what's stopping you? But you should probably look at your team first because, uh, yeah. Now, our last one from the Discord server comes from Lord 3 Gaming. What's your feeling when bullying the whole server as a lord or king, aka zombie mode, and see them complain? Oh boy. Now if I'm being completely honest, I don't play zombie mode just to make people lose. 
Overall, I play zombie mode just for the fun of having to be able to do it. And because it's actually a lot fun to just sit back and just not really have to worry about actually doing much of the work because you're kind of just running around killing people. Now, I don't necessarily feel bad about making them lose, but I don't really find it funny either. It's kind of just, hey, look at me. I won. Because there's really no direct reward for winning on zombie mode, I really just play it just for fun. So there's, there's not really much going on there, but you will see me on zombie mode anytime you're in a server with me. That is, unless it's hard mode or zombie mode 4 is too far into the game for me to actually be able to do stuff. Now these next two are ones asked in the comment section which haven't already been asked in the Discord server. Now this first one is from Unresolved. How long and why did you decide to create TBBF videos? So my first TBBF video was this one, which was playable characters in a nutshell, which was 11 months ago from the making of this video. Two months from then I was like, this isn't that good. So I remastered it, added more content to it, and made it a lot higher quality in general. Now the reason why I started making these videos is because this is one of my favorite games since the first time I started playing, since early 2019, probably later than that, and all the way up to now. And the first event I actually played was the Christmas 2019 event with Frosty, and lost. <laughs> Overall what I guess the reason why is because I wanted to do something with this channel after abandoning it for such a long time, and I was like, I don't want to quit this, I want to keep going. And so, I decided to make GBF content. And the last one for today comes from Base44. How old? 15. June 22nd. And that about wraps it up. Once again, I'd like to thank you all for the support. It's been a whole lot of fun. And I'll see you all in the next video. Bye now.